Local students take cover and employees head to safe rooms, all part of the great tornado drill. SNN meteorologist Cassie Nall has more. Many counties around the state participated in the Great Tornado Drill, an initiative organized by the National Weather Service. During an El Nino weather pattern, the severe weather season tends to be especially active in the southeast. The Great Tornado Drill was the perfect way to teach students at Just for Girls Academy in Bradenton how to react when a tornado warning is issued for their area. Principal Deanna Smith says that the girls have been learning about weather safety and were able to put their knowledge to the test during the drill. We talked to them about um, the importance of being safe and just like in a fire drill or any other drill, you know, listening and all of the procedures for that, as well as why we duck and cover. Mrs. Russo's first grade class demonstrated exactly what you should do during a tornado warning. They stayed calm and quickly moved to the lowest level and most interior space in the building. From there, they ducked and covered their heads and necks until the all clear was given. For Principal Smith and the rest of the staff at the school, there were many benefits to participating in the Great Tornado Drill, but one reason stands out above the rest. The safety of the children is paramount and um, we want them not to be afraid if there is in the event of an emergency situation. And the more preparation they have, the more comfortable they feel and safe they feel. And if you missed out this time, another statewide tornado drill will take place during the Florida Severe Weather Awareness Week in late February. In Bradenton, Cassie Nall, SNN, the Suncoast News Network.